It's 11 trivia questions on Disney animals. All your cutest sidekicks are in this episode, so get ready to have some fun. This is Trivia with Buds. What it be and welcome to another episode of the Trivia with Buds podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Buds. Thanks for checking out my show. If you're brand new to the show, hit subscribe and never miss an episode as they come out every single day. I'm getting ready to send out all the Patreon rewards for January, which is uh, coming to an end rather quickly here. The start of the year, the first month of the new decade is already over, and I have all this cool stuff to send listeners and fans of the show. If you want to be one of those listeners and fans, go to patreon.com slash trivia with buds and sign up for all kinds of goodies. This is kind of cool. If I'm sending you any boxes in the future... I'm holding this up on YouTube. It is brand new Trivia with Buds labels, uh, like packing tape that uh, you wet on one side and you lay it on the box. It's kind of like the same material that comes on an Amazon box that's very easy to rip open, but it has my face on it. That's the first podcast artwork logo, the blue one that we used for the first year of the daily edition of the show. We're now on an orange logo and about halfway through the year on that one. So uh, I've been ordering a bunch of cool promotional stuff to kind of promote myself a little bit better in 2020. I've got koozies. I've got t-shirts. I've got uh, this packing tape. I've got enamel pins. And uh, I made some really cool posters for this Brews and Bros event recently where um, each poster is like an 11 by 17 turned horizontally. So like landscape. And they have different directions on them. And I can hang them on the front of like a table or on the top of a tent like I did over this past weekend. And it says like, hey, follow me on social media. Get a sticker for the podcast. Uh, Become a Patreon uh, subscriber for a dollar or more, and you get a Sharknado headshot. You know, stuff like that. So if you see me out and about anywhere in Southern California or on the road somewhere around the country in this uh, start to the decade, 2020, you uh, might be able to see those signs, and you might be able to get some cool bonus stuff from me just for uh, following me on social media or taking a picture and tagging me in it. There's all these different signs I made. So be on the lookout for those. Today's episode is all about Disney animals. So a lot of sidekicks, a lot of uh, Thumper-esque questions in here. Uh, Actually, there's no Thumper. (laughs) No Thumper question on this episode. But that's the first sidekick. I don't know if that popped into my head from Bambi. Uh, Speaking of sidekicks, oh, man. Guys, we're going to do a whole episode of The Mandalorian very soon because I'm going to do one at my live nights in February. But uh, I'm going to hold this up for you if you're watching on YouTube. And if you're not, I'll share it in the Discord app chat or on social media. It is Baby Yoda as an enamel pin, and it says, Freaking Adorable I Am. And it is an awesome little piece to add to your enamel pin collection, along with that new Trivia with Buds logo pin. Uh, this is a really cool pin from Drew Blank. Check him out at drewblank.com. The ears stick off on this thing. They're very big and floppy. And it says, Freaking Adorable I Am. So that is a very cool pin that Drew sent me as a little bonus item for ordering a bunch of cool stuff from him. You should order some cool stuff from him as well. Uh, my wife's going to love that pin for Valentine's Day. That's like uh, probably going to be a big item this year for Valentine's Day is Baby Yoda related stuff. Shirts and and uh, towels and things. I saw a Baby Yoda towel already at the store. It's nuts. It's nuts. It's taking over. It's taking over the world. And then Baby Jabba. Oh, once they may start making the Baby Jabba stuff, I'm going to start buying that. <laughs> That'll be fun. I saw a Baby Jabba meme where it was like uh, freshman year versus senior year. And it was Baby Jabba. And then it was uh, full grown Jabba in his palace looking real gross. And that was me, I think, freshman year to senior year. I got a lot grosser as the years went on, as do we all. All right, we're going to jump into today's episode. It is 11 trivia questions all about Disney animals. So get ready. We're doing it right now. Here we go. All right, guys, we are starting this thing off right with some Disney animal trivia. Here's question number one. What type of animal is Sven from the Frozen series. Question number one, what type of animal is Sven from the Frozen series? That's number one. Question number two, what is the name of the panther in the Jungle Book? Question number two, what is the name of the panther in the Jungle Book? Question number three, in what decade did the Aristocats get released? In what decade did the film The Aristocats come out? Question 
Question number four, in what movie would you find Doug the dog who wears a special collar that translates his speech to English? What movie features Doug the dog, the talking dog? Number four. Question number five, what's the trumpet-playing gator's name from The Princess and the Frog? What is the name of the trumpet-playing gator from that movie? Number five. Question number six, what color shirt does Nick the Fox wear in Zootopia? What color shirt does Nick the Fox wear in the movie Zootopia? Question number seven, in The Lion King, what creatures do Timon and Pumbaa chase away when they first meet Simba? In The Lion King, what creatures do Timon and Pumbaa first chase away when they first meet Simba? Number seven. Question number eight, Bella Note is a famous song played over a dinner scene in what film? Bella Note is a famous song played over a dinner scene in what film? Number eight. Question number nine, who did the voice of Iago in Aladdin? Question number nine, who did the voice of Iago in Aladdin? Two questions left to go on this Disney Animals quiz. Number 10, what type of creatures are Bianca and Bernard in a hit 1977 movie? What type of creatures are Bianca and Bernard in a hit 1977 movie? And your two-point bonus question, number 11, for two points, how many actual puppies are in the litter that Perdita delivers in the 101 Dalmatians animated film? How many puppies does she actually have herself in 101 Dalmatians? Those are all your questions for Disney Animals. We'll be right back in just a second with the answers. We're back with the answers to Disney Animal Trivia. Let's see how you did on this 11-question quiz. Here's number one. What type of animal is Sven from the Frozen series? And Sven is a reindeer. A reindeer. Question number two. What's the name of the panther in the Jungle Book? His name is Baghira. Baghira. Question number three, in what decade did the Aristocats get released? That was the start of the 70s. That was actually 1970, right at the start there. Number four, in what movie would you find the uh, Doug the Dog, who wears a special collar that translates his speech to English? That movie is called Up. If you can get past the sad intro, you get to meet Doug the Dog. Number five, what's the trumpet-playing gator's name from The Princess and the Frog? He just wants to play a tune. His name is Louis, Louis the alligator. Number six, what color shirt does Nick the Fox wear in Zootopia? That is voiced by Jason Bateman, and he wears a green shirt. Sly as a fox, that character Nick. Number seven, in The Lion King, what creatures do Timon and Pumbaa chase away when they first meet Simba? That would be vultures. They chase away a bunch of vultures while Simba is laying there, and then he grows up rather quick after meeting Timon and Pumbaa. And number eight, Bella Note is a famous song played over a dinner scene in what film? That's Lady and the Tramp. Lady and the Tramp with the spaghetti. Tried doing that with my wife. Not as uh, sexy as it is, as you would think. Not as, not as, <laughs> not as romantic. <laughs> number nine, who did the voice of Iago in Aladdin? That's Gilbert Gottfried. Gilbert Gottfried. And number 10, what type of creatures are Bianca and Bernard? In a hit 1977 movie, they are mice in The Rescuers, in The Rescuers Down Under, about 10 years later. Number 11, for two points, how many actual puppies are in the litter that Perdita delivers in 101 Dalmatians, the animated film? She only has 15 puppies. All the rest are uh, rescued and then adopted by the parents uh, that Cruella de Vil had kidnapped. All these, almost... Uh, 101 Dalmatians. <laughs> so 15 were Perdidas. And those are your answers for today's episode on Disney Animals. I hope you had fun playing along and learning some stuff. Uh, if you know a diehard Disney fan, send them the link to this episode and say, hey, how many of these can you get out of 11 if they uh, are real smart, real smarty pants, and they have annual passes to Disneyland and Disney World and things? I bet you they will do pretty good. It's time for the question of the day, brought to you by Funky Monkey Designs of San Dimas, California. Check them out for all your printing needs at fmdesignsinc.com. Question is, who created Batman? Who is the sole creator of Batman? Tweet me your answer at RyanBuds or email RyanBuds at gmail.com to be eligible for a prize. Yesterday's question of the day answer was Steve Ditko, Ditko for who created, uh, co-created Spider-Man with Stan Lee. That was Steve Ditko. And your trivia team name of today is Farah Leakey Fawcett. Farah Leakey 
Fawcett. Use that next time you play Team Trivia. Check out all my locations at my website, TriviaWithBuds.com. And don't forget, Patreon.com slash TriviaWithBuds if you want to get a bunch of cool stuff in the mail monthly. Even for a buck, you get access to our ongoing pop culture chat room on Discord and you get uh, our digital newsletter, which I send out every month with a few puzzles and a little letter from me and some cool episodes of the podcast you might have missed. Thanks for listening. Thanks for telling a friend. And we'll see you tomorrow for more Trivia with Buds. Cheers. Thank you.